This video is going to walk you through how to edit and print the student growth plan in Skyward Student. First thing you want to do is go to Skyward Student and log in with your CSC credentials. Once in your Skyward account from Teacher Access, click My Classes. Once in My Classes, you want to go to one of your homeroom classes and click Class Options. From Class Options, this menu is located on the left-hand side of the screen. Select Custom Forms at the bottom. On the next screen, the first thing you want to do is update the views from Main by clicking on that little downward arrow and you want to select the SGP, which stands for the Student Growth Plan. Once you've done that, it's now time to start editing the Student Growth Plans for each individual student. You will see each student listed individually. Click on the arrow next to each student's name. When the menu expands, click Edit, and that will open up the SGP for that specific student. The student information and school information will be auto-populated for you. The attendance will be added when you go to print your SGP. So it is important and it's actually recommended that you talk to your school administration to find out if there's a specific date they would like you to print the SGP. The reason for that is just if you have if you have families in your school who have students in multiple grade levels, it could be confusing or they could be a little frustrated to find if their students attendance varies because they are printed on different days. So just something to be aware of and something I would check with your administration about. But you'll fill out the learning skills, the growth and action plan. When you're done, click Save. It will take you back to the list of students and you can just keep going down the list to each individual student. When you're ready to print the SGP for your class, click the Print for Entire Class option. That will take you to the next screen. The first time you do this, you do need to add a custom form report template. To do that, you click on Add. Give your template a description. It's recommended maybe SGP or something that you'll remember that this is the student growth plan that you're printing. Under Available Custom Forms, you want to locate the SGP that was added or that view that you were just going from. So in this example, it's SGP 2025. You select it. Click Add. It will then appear under Selected Custom Forms. Once you see that under Selected Custom Forms, click Save and Print. It'll take you back to the screen you started from. You'll see that new template was created there for you. When you're ready to print, make sure it's selected. Click Print. And the print, it'll process your request. And when this is done, We'll get the screen that allows you to download the files and you can print them from your computer. If anytime you want to access your print queue, remember that little printer in the upper right hand corner is where you can go access your print queue and see a list of the things you've sent through this processing request to download and print.